Hey everybody, it's Dr. Mark Hyman. I'm here in my office at the Ultra Wellness Center in Lenox, Massachusetts, and I'm here to talk to you about water. Water is critical. As we know, we're all made up of water, and the quality of the water we drink matters. Uh, in fact, most of us don't realize that if you just turn on the tap, you're getting all sorts of nasty stuff. You've heard about uh, hexavalent chromium from California. You've heard about the lead in the water in Flint, Michigan, but there's a lot of other contaminants. I read an article recently that there are 38 different wastewater contaminants in water. I mean, you ever think about it, all the women taking birth control pills or people taking antibiotics, where do those go? They go into the urine, they go into our water supply, and they get contaminated in our water. So it's really important to drink pure, clean water. Now, what people don't realize is that you think, oh, I'm gonna have bottled water, that's pretty good. Well, guess what? Bottled water also has problems. One, you don't always know where it's from. It can have phthalates, which are toxins, and bisphenol A, which promotes diabetes and cancer and lots of other things. So at my house and here at the Ultra Wellness Center, we use reverse osmosis water, which is filtered through a multi-step process, cleans out all the contaminants, super awesome, tastes good, takes out the minerals, you have to add back the minerals, but uh, it's kind of a big deal. You have to install it, it's expensive, you have to change the filter, you have to remember, and it's sort of a pain in the neck. But there is this amazing new filter that I found, which I've been looking for for years, called Aquatru. It's sitting right here behind me. And this filter is a countertop filter that literally filters out all the same things that my massive ultra under the sink uh, reverse osmosis filter does, but it's super easy to use. It's on the counter. It tells you when the filter needs to be changed every six months. It's really inexpensive. And I, I really encourage everybody to think about the quality of the water. You don't want to be getting these contaminants. This puts it through this multi-stage process, four-stage process, cleans out 20 different contaminants. And, and when you drink pure clean water, you're gonna feel better, your health's gonna be better, and I encourage you to check it out. Great Christmas gift, and um, I hope you all feel healthy and good. Here we have a Brita pitcher water purifier. Here we have a Zero water, and, uh, and here we have Aquatru. We have liter bottles of uh, Dive Coca-Cola. I'm gonna Fill up Aquatru. And we're not going to turn Aquatru on yet. We'll give uh, the Zero Water and the Brita head start. We'll start with the Brita. And I'm just going to go ahead and fill it up here. We have rinsed out the Brita filter. Oh! So even though this is a 10 cup filter, you actually have to stand here and keep refilling it because even though the clean water portion of this pitcher holds 10 cups, the top part doesn't. So we'll have to come back to that and we'll start the zero water going. We rinsed out both of the Brita and the zero water filters before we started. Uh, which you have to do, that's part of the instructions. And I see we're going to have the same problem with zero water, which is even though it holds 10 cups, it doesn't even hold 8 cups of, of tap water. So we'll get back to that one. And now both of these have head starts, and now we're going to turn on the Aquatru. I'll ask now uh, Max, our camera operator, to go ahead and uh, switch this into... Uh, uh, time lapse so that we can get through this demonstration, which looks like it's going to take uh, quite some time. Okay, so Aquatru is uh, now gone into the pause position, and what that means is, is that. The purified Diet Coke is now here in the front clean water tank. It looks like it's just pure water here. And in the back tank, which is the tap water tank, or in this case, the Diet Coke tank, now what we have is highly concentrated Diet Coke back here and absolutely pure drinking water here. On the zero water, uh, it looks like it's still working its way through here. And we don't have enough time left here today. It's a Friday afternoon to let it continue its work. So I'm just going to try to 
pour the Diet Coke, which was never filtered by zero water, back into this pitcher here. I'm dripping all over the table. I'll clean it up afterwards. Okay. And as we can see, this is the Brita. And the Brita has barely uh, touched the Diet Coke that we put in. It's just dripping through a little bit at a time. So obviously, uh, the Brita is just no match for the Diet Coke. So we'll just pour that out here, the leftover Diet Coke. And well, since Aquatrue is having no problem with it, we'll just give it all to Aquatrue to finish going. It'll continue filtering that. And down here is the little bit of the filtered Diet Coke that Brita was filtering. And it looks pretty much like Diet Coke. And now we're going to take the zero water. This is the filter that's supposed to leave your water with zero contaminants in it. And pretty much like Diet Coke. Let's take a look at the purified Diet Coke that's coming out of Aquatrue. Looks completely clear. So here's our demonstration. You've seen it for yourself. We've tested Aquatrue against zero water and against uh, Brita. And only Aquatrue was able to take Diet Coke and turn it back into pure drinking water. Thank you so much.